Late Night Health continues with Robert Clancy, author of The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Soul. And we're going to listen to Robert talk about silver linings. I guess behind every dark cloud is one? Yes. uh, Silver linings are those things that I find when, you know, something negative happens in your life. There's always something positive there. So today's inspirational thought is, When life seems to be taking you for a ride, know that divine love will always ultimately be the final destination. So trust in the lessons of the journey and believe in the truth discovered in that purpose. I've always found that after something seemingly terrible happens to you, bad news, a setback, or what have you, I've always discovered something positive in there. And nearly 100% of the time, it far outweighs any negativity. Have you discovered this too, Mark? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, you know, when you when something, you know, a tragedy, personal tragedy happens, uh, somebody gets sick, uh, and and you worry, uh, and you find out it's it's really only a minor issue. That would be a silver lining to me, right? Yeah, you know, it happens all the time. My mother, you know, at the end she had cancer, but then she she got uh, de- uh, you know dementia. And she forgot that she had cancer. And literally, I think it extended her life. And, and that was the silver lining. You know, it seemed like it was something horrible that my mom has dementia, but it turned out to be a beautiful thing. Interesting, because my mother also had dementia. And a few days before she passed, uh, she uh, was in the hospital and I called her and she thanked me for sending her to New Orleans for the wonderful restaurant. And I, I knew because she was in a hospital, the food was not very good. I was happy that she was happy with that. And, yeah, and you're right, right there with it, yes. Robert, we will talk again next week. I look forward to it. The Hitchhiker's Guide to the Soul. And, of course, you can find out more about Robert by going to LateNightHealth.com. More coming up. Don't go away. We go to New York City where Greg McPherson, the CEO of... A new of a, uh, I guess the company's been around for a while, uh, and he is the CEO of Mito Q. We're going to be talking to him about uh, uh, CoQ10 and a revolutionary formulation of that, which is known as Mito Q. Uh, Greg, welcome to Late Night Health. Thank you very much, Mike. You're a, on your show. Thank you. You are, uh, by trade, a pharmacist. Am I correct? That's absolutely correct. I uh, went through Otago University in Dunedin in New Zealand just a little too long ago is all. <laughs> He's young, by the way, guys. I, I know how old he is. Um, and you you sold your, your... I guess you had some stores and you sold them and were looking for something to do and you hooked up with the guys at Mito Q. Yeah, absolutely. I was... Um, I had recently sold my business and learnt about Mito Q um, and um, did a little bit of work consulting for the, the guys. And then once that was done, they invited me on to uh, lead the team. What is Mito Q designed for? What is it? It's a, it's a form of, of uh, CoQ10, am I correct? Yeah, that's right. It's, it's, it's actually a brand new type of antioxidant called a, called a mitochondrial targeted antioxidant. And it's so cool because it actually targets these little things in our cells called mitochondria. Those are like little hairs, aren't they, in this, within the cells? Yeah, they, they, look, they're, just, they're, like, they're called cellular batteries, another term for them. And they, essentially what they do is they take the food we eat and the air we breathe and they convert it into an energy that uh, or type of energy that our cells can use, and in 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 th- this was has been developed over a number of years. I think you said it was over ten years old. Yeah, that's right. The guys uh, came up with the idea um, around fifteen years ago. So we, we've been around a long time, although we've really been on the market only for a few years. And the reason for that is there's just been so much research behind this product before we decided to, to bring it to to the public and make it available. Are you doing double blind studies and that kind of thing on on the product? Yeah, exactly. We've done phase two clinical trials and we're doing human trials at around about, I think it's now it's five universities in the States at the moment. So they're looking at its effect across all sorts of uh, conditions associated with kidney health and lung health and and heart health. Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, um, multiple sclerosis, and the list goes on and on. Yeah, well, it's, these mitochondria, um, for, for those of your uh, audience, I guess, that don't know what they are, they're, 
they're essentially these little batteries and they produce energy for our cells and they're just absolutely vital. If these things aren't working properly, then uh, it's, it's not great for your health. And one of the reasons um, that they decline essentially is in the process of making energy, they generate about, let's say, 90-95% of the free radicals in the cell. And we, we all know free radicals are not necessarily great for us. And so what happens with these mitochondria is when we're young, we've got absolutely loads of free radicals that are, uh, sorry, antioxidants that are produced naturally inside these little mitochondria. Which so, contradict the, the free radicals, as I understand it. I- exactly. But uh, unfortunately, these natural antioxidants decline over time. So, so as we get into our 30s and 40s, the free radicals that are being generated by these mitochondria start to impact on how well they work. In fact, they decline in function around about 10% per decade from our 30s. And and what that does essentially is that our cells start to become starved of energy. So um, that is quite closely related to ageing and health conditions and so on when these cells just don't get the energy they need. Can... We reverse or at least slow down the aging process, in your opinion? You know, I think we can. I think over the last, say, five years or so, that uh, there are, it's becoming, I guess, an understanding that there are <coughs> levers and cogs that you can pull to, to slow down the aging process. And some of them are linked to these mitochondria because if, if you imagine a cell as being a wee bit of a, I guess a household or a factory, they get damaged and you need to do housekeeping and repair and and maintenance and those sorts of things. And as we get older and we've got less energy from these mitochondria, those sorts of things, like the housekeeping, it it doesn't get looked after quite as well. So, you know, the cell, if it's a heart cell, is going to beep because that's the main thing. But uh, the rubbish builds up and repair doesn't happen as we get older. And and that's somewhat what what we could say is, is the aging process. So what we've been able to do is, is get antioxidants back into the mitochondria, and that's something no one else has been able to do. And when we do that, the mitochondria get more energy, and, and that literally means that that cell can get repairing things and, and do all that housework that it is not necessarily doing. That they did at, when they were when when the human when when we were in our twenties. Yeah. Uh, exactly. How does the because this is a supplement? Hmm. How does the how is the the traditional medical community accepting this because they don't tend to do things like that? Yeah, so the, the, I guess the doctors that are uh, open to um, I guess integrative healthcare, which is basically the balancing of nutrition and supplements with with what we know is traditionally medication, are embracing it with open arms. The uh, we've we've just got so many studies showing that when you correct mitochondrial function that uh, it has a positive impact on, 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 on health. And so those that are spe- specialising, I guess, in heart health and liver health, brain health, that sort of thing, are, are looking at this and going, right, this is a really useful tool to help us manage those sorts of conditions. You're actually in New York. Uh, you, you've, you've come up from New Zealand, and uh, you, are, uh, you, you, you presented, I think, the last few days at a traditional medical symposium yeah that's right it was it was actually an integrative practitioner symposium so these are uh, doctors who are expert at really understanding the impact of nutrition and supplements on cells and uh, it was a hugely encouraging conference because uh, when we spoke to these doctors and discussed this you know might IQ um, they, they they immediately I guess understand it they understand that mitochondria is, is a huge um, mitochondrial health is a huge arm of of health that's being investigated right now. There's just huge amounts of resource going behind it, and uh, and and we, we talk with them also around about the fact that the uh, National Institute of Health, that uh, health research arm, I guess, of the U.S. government, has been paying attention to MitoQ and that they've invited us into an anti-aging program, which is pretty exciting to be a part of. Are you, are, uh, you, are you available here in the States now, or have yeah, you been? Yeah, we have. We've actually been available for a couple of years now, and uh, uh, from later this year, we'll actually be selling MitoQ from America. Gotcha. 
Gotcha. Uh, the one of the problems that I have with pharmaceuticals is the price. Okay, yeah. I mean we had you know here it probably made worldwide news when uh, this investor took over a company and raised the the price of a product you know thousands of percent. Um, is is MitoQ a inexpensive product? Yeah, look, it is, and I remember that uh, that particular incident, incident <laughs> and it's um, it's just yeah, it's appalling. Absolutely appalling. Yeah. Now um, we don't have we don't have the uh, in New Zealand you have uh, national health care. Yeah, that's right. So essentially, the government funds most things, and, and uh, we, we uh, people pay a small co-payment of five dollars per prescription. So. In the scheme of things, compared to what uh, Americans pay for medicine, it's it's a very very moderate uh, system. However, the one negative to that is that you guys get access to a whole lot of new medications, and um, and we're a wee bit slow on that front. Gotcha. But um, in terms of MitoQ, um, we're talking a couple of bucks a day. So uh, for something which is so critical to your health, these mitochondria to to, to pay that, you know, it's, it's not not a not a big price to pay at all. You told me that it was that in some people they see results within days, others it takes some time. Yeah, it, look, it all depends on how well these mitochondria are working, and we all have differing degrees of it. So, you know, one or two of us might have perhaps we're not thinking quite as well as we used to back in the early days, or it could be that we've got, you know, starting to get some health issues or liver issues. So, our mitochondria, they, 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 they're in, they, have different levels of function, I guess, in each of our, each of our organs. So someone might take MitoQ and find that uh, immediately they get a boost in energy. And this supplement's not just for people who are perhaps not uh, f- feeling ultimately healthy. They, it's a very much, in, uh, I guess, a tonic for anybody over the age of 40. But yes, they could notice something immediately, or we typically say, look, wait four to, four to six weeks, and, and really, to give it a decent go, three months. And, and that gives the body time to um, adjust and and, uh, and fully get the benefit of it. The and you and there are five clinical studies going on in the U.S. So they're under the FDA uh, guidelines. Yeah, look, we've the, the the interesting thing with this compound is that the researchers probably around about ten years ago started to connect mitochondrial dysfunction to a whole bunch of different conditions, and there and there are some of the major ones as well that. People are dealing with, and so really, I get emails at least once a week from researchers around the world, including the states, to say, "Look, hey, can we trial this uh, your supplement with our particular disease model or condition?" So I was on the a call with uh, someone today uh, talking about lung conditions and how um, that's quite tied to mitochondrial dysfunction. It, it's it, it, you know what's fascinating is that the the traditional medical community is taking a, a good hard look at this. Uh, the name of the product is uh, MitoQ, M-I-T-O-Q, and uh, do a Google search on it and you'll find it if you need it. Uh, uh, I really appreciate your, uh, your joining us today. And uh, Greg, uh, enjoy your stay in, uh, in New York and we will... I look forward to uh, hearing more news about MitoQ as it uh, becomes available. Thank you very much, Mark. Thank you very much. Uh, hey, join us at LateNightHealth.com. And if you didn't know, we're now on iTunes. Yep, you can just go to LateNightHealth.com, look on the, uh, click on the iTunes logo, and it'll take you right to our iTunes page. I'm Mark Allen. Don't go away. We've got more coming up as we talk about the race for the cure. More of that coming up in just a few moments. Don't go away. Do you have $10,000 or more in credit card debt that is straining your monthly budget? Have you been turned down for a personal loan, credit card, or mortgage? We'll quickly connect you with expert financial resources that provide free information that helps save you time and money and get you back on track. Don't spend hours a day searching for help. With just one phone call, we'll quickly connect you with your debt solution. We have programs to settle your debt, lower your bills, and cut your monthly payments. Call 800-989-8123 to get a free debt analysis to help you reduce your debt and get you back on track. 
The call is free, secure, and confidential. Call 800-989-8123. 800-989-8123. 800-989-8123. That's 800-989-8123. Thanks for calling Consolidated Credit Counseling Services. Can I help you? I sure hope so. I'm in debt. Is it credit card bills? Yes, I have two credit cards that I'm making minimum payments on and another that I'm behind on. I owe about $5,000. What interest rates are you paying? Between 18 and 22%. At that rate, it'll take over 20 years to pay off. Wow, 20 years? What Consolidated Credit can do is work with your creditors to lower your payments and reduce or even eliminate your interest charges. You should be able to pay everything off in three or four years. What do I have to do? Just give me some details and get ready to celebrate your freedom from debt. We're Consolidated Credit. We're here to give you freedom from debt. Call now for your free consultation. If I had known it was this easy, I would have called years ago. Call 1-800-229-1964. 1-800-229-1964. That's 1-800-229-1964. Consolidated Credit Counseling Services Incorporated, 5701 West Sunlight Boulevard, Fort Lauderdale, Florida, 33313. Not a loan company, licensed by New York Department of Financial Services and by the Vermont Department of Financial Regulation, Maryland DM19, Oregon DM80031.